Well, the thing that I learned from uh, the past weekend is that one dance, one good dance, is not good enough. Forward, Ronde. There's even more pressure this week because we've got two difficult dances and, and to be safe, you really need to be good in both dances. There's more of a challenge on every single week and knowing there's a place in the semi-final at stake, it's um, definitely fueled me even more. This week, we've got the passionate ballroom tango. <laughs> I wanted to do the tango so much, so I'm so excited. Well, the tango has to be a very sharp dance and very passionate, you know, sometimes we look at each other. So we need to make sure that we nail it. I think it's great that we've we had the paso now that we're going into doing the tango. It's very passionate, just like the paso is, so I think I can take what I learned from that into this one. The way the Cha 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 is going so far, it's going to be a wicked dance on Saturday. I've been so excited about learning the Cha Cha. We haven't really done a sort of dance like that for ages, it feels like, and it's really sort of cheeky and sassy and cool. The Cha 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 is a very staccato dance. It's a very quick dance, very fast fit action, and everything has to be perfectly on time. Two, three, four, one. He's not got through past the quarterfinal yet, so it would be amazing to get him through to the semi-final.